So today we'll be changing a bunch of die in the number 40 series machine. That's a 65 ton or larger Saskatchewan iron worker. First, remove the stripper out of the way. Slide out of the way. Turn the machine on. Stroke the machine down into the die. Put your expose your punch nut and your punch. Take your given wrench. Remove the punch nut from the punch ram. Turn the machine on. Stroke the punch ram out of the way. Machine off. That will remove your punch from your punch nut. And Scotchman gives a 17 millimeter wrench to remove the die. There is a bolt on the side. Remove the Remove the die, pull the die out to change, insert the die, tighten the nut, take a new punch into the nut, put it inside the die, turn the machine on, stroke the ram all the way down, you will not hit the standard punch in the nut, kill the machine, screw the nut on. If you can screw the nut on, that is good. If you cannot, you must loosen these two bolts below and adjust the die shoe so it will line up and screw onto the punch ram. Now that we have done this, tighten, turn the machine on, double check, make sure it all lines up. That is how you change a punch and die. Put the stripper back in place and go. The most important thing that I highly, highly recommend when assembling, you type everything when it's inside the die. That is the safest way to do it. And that is how we change a punch and die on the Swiss Iron.